a uh, little bit of problems on vacation, but you know it is what it is. It is what it is. And you already know the motto, carpe diem, be thankful, strive to be happy. And it works out very well. Even while the ski's down, yo, the nav bow is down. I got customer support for Subblue helping me out. So we'll see how that goes. I'll give an update on that. Um, but you know, they were very responsive. I'm out in the middle of nowhere, shot them an email and they got back to me. So I gave them what they wanted. We'll see how it goes from there. Um, Cause you know, I just got it for my birthday. I've only used it like four times. Uh, you know, it's cool. Everybody was loving it. They saw me ripping on it and then like, four minutes later just stop uh, but you know things happen but that's what I'm trying to say carpe diem be thankful strive to be happy like the skis down the navbo's not working but it's a beautiful time have all the family here still able to get out in the water if we need to you know it's just it's good things are good and they will always get better as long as you try to be positive and do positive things usually you'll get positive results back yeah that's K life style all right, so this is it, I think. We got the Subblue back from Subblue, the company itself. Um, so here's a little story. Obviously, I was on vacation, as you've seen, had issues with the, with the, uh, with the unit. So I reached out to Subblue via email and just asked them, you know, what could I do? Was there anything I could kind of do to uh, diagnose it on my end? Or was there anywhere I could send it to or bring it to to get fixed? Um, so they got back to me uh, pretty quickly via email um, and I basically had to ship it out to California. So I used a pretty good box and used all the packing materials we get from all the Amazon purchases, did it up real nice and sent it out to them. They gave me the, uh, um, the what do you call it, the information to send it out and so forth. I didn't have to pay any money. So here we are now. I got it back after about almost two weeks. Uh, between when I had the incident and um, uh, eh, just a bit, little bit over two weeks since I had the incident. Had to wait to get back from vacation before I could send it out. Um, so they did pretty good, I will say, as far as uh, getting it back to me. Now, does it work? What can I expect? What condition is it in? So that's really why I'm doing this video. Not only just to say like, hey, there was a problem, you know, boohoo sub blue. Which I really won't say that. I mean, who's to, who knows what? You know what I mean? There's always a lemon here and there. There's always just things that can happen. You know what I mean? So let's see, um, you know, how they did. So number one, they sent it back in one of these cool cases. Now, if you check out my original video of the sub blue, it came with one of these. So I guess now I have two of them. So I'd say that's a pretty good start for the company. Let's uh, let's see, you know, what we can expect here. So unfortunately, they did not load it up with a whole bunch of new goodies. I would have been very happy if they had, uh, you know, gave me some extras. But, you know, it is what it is. Take the unit back. And um, yeah, there's a little dust on it and stuff, but you know, it, I'm pretty sure it's mine. <laughs> now, I guess maybe I should have uh, like wrote my name or something on the inside here. Although I will say I did have to provide them the serial number so I can definitely verify, um, you know, and double check that serial number to make sure that it is mine. Um, clearly it's not a brand new one, so I just wouldn't want them to replace it with some other one or get it mixed up or whatever. Um, but it looks like it's in pretty good condition. Now, I'm going to go ahead and put a battery in it right now and we'll see if it turns on. And then of course the next step is to get out on the water and see if this thing works and hopefully I can then bring it to Lake George. So let's try that battery right now. Now, if you recall, it was giving me that error message, zero, zero or whatever. All right. See if she turns on. Sub blue. So we are getting the actual uh, message there, or regular screen. So free dive. Let's see. So 
that worked. Let me go into turbo. Sport. I'll do all three. Why not? Now it's in sport. And it's working. And now for turbo. Turbo mode. Turbo man. <laughs> Remember that? What was that? Uh, jingle all the way. Love that movie. Anyway, turbo mode. Alright, so that's good news. They at least shipped back a working unit. Hopefully it will continue working for SK. Uh, again, we're going to get out there right now and test this baby out. So let's go do it. Let's uh, wish a little luck for SK and hopefully it'll keep working if it does now. Um, you know, at Lake George because I really want to use it in a big lake. Just, you know, place with really good water and stuff. You know, there's some really good areas there with clear water for like 20 feet or more. So, you know, this should be pretty cool. And of course, I will be posting up new videos with this thing as long as it keeps working. SK Lifestyle. It's beautiful out here right now. So, let's get to it. <laughs> Whoa! That's like two feet higher than this one could do. <laughs> that was like, yeah. All right, so we fare pretty well. Obviously, she's working. That's the main thing. That's what I'm excited about. What I'm happy for. I'd have to give a shout out to Sub Blue. Two thumbs up. They did everything they could in their power to get it rectified and quickly. Now, I had to ship it out pretty far, but they paid for shipping. It didn't take long to get out there, and they got it back to me in about a week or so. So I can't really complain, and it was fully working. I haven't had a problem since. Now, it did suck that I couldn't use it on my major vacation, the one I was really looking forward to using it for, but at least I was able to use it on the other one. So, not too bad. This thing is really cool. It's full of electronics, so, you know, things happen. It is what it is. Hopefully, I don't have any more issues from here on out. If I do, of course, I'll be putting it up on SK Lifestyle. And oh, by the way, follow me now on Instagram. Yeah, that's right. S.K underscore lifestyle. I'll be posting a lot of behind the scenes stuff, other pictures and really short clips of stuff you probably would never get on my normal YouTube channel. So YouTube is not going away. Of course, this is my main thing. This is what I love to do. I appreciate all the support all the views, all the subscribes. And if you haven't subscribed already, be sure to at the bottom down below. But um, yeah, if you want some more content from SK Lifestyle, check me out on there. Of course, I'm on Facebook and Twitter as well. And with that said, I'll leave it right here. I appreciate you watching. I will be doing more videos on this, showing the comparison between my old one and this one, as well as just some other action shots and stuff. And of course, next year, um, any vacations I go on, uh, definitely be bringing this. Hopefully I can touch some clear water, uh, you know, hit the uh, Atlantic somewhere. 
in the south where the water's nice crisp and blue so we can get some really good action shots i won't give anything away because things are still up in the air but hey who knows you need to subscribe so you can always catch it when it comes out appreciate you watching see you next time